specifically Odoamne, because he's always, I think, a little sheepish about this kind of stuff, but takes him out of his comfort zone. I'm calling you out, Odo. If you want to, if you want to do a cosplay bet, let's go. And there get killed again with no vision from absolutely nowhere, because Zoe is a balanced champion. Thank you, Riot Games. Thank you for this amazing champion. Brain effect mood helps your serotonin levels and makes you feel more relaxed. Huh. Ah, oh, and we lose Barry because our jungler missed Smite, but you know what? That's okay. We all make mistakes. And um, yeah, next game will be better, I'm sure. <laughs> Hello everyone, this is Darius from Shotcaller, joined here by Dracos, or should I say Rakan? Rakan, I prefer Mr. Rakan, actually. Mr. Rakan, I apologize, but uh, yeah, what has led to the series of events that led to this outfit? Alright, so if you're not a Euphoria viewer to catch you up, we bet against G2 Esports winning the split, specifically Yankos and Mickey, and the loser was supposed to do, uh, it was supposed to be, Frost was KDA Akali, and I was KDA Evelyn. Um, Gained some weight, the KDA Evelyn cosplay we had didn't fit, but then people thought it was a good idea, so they doubled down and got us, rather than these like cheap, like I, mean, I don't know where they're made, but like really cheap generic cosplays, they got us these super custom made ones. Um, and so now I'm LEC themed Rakan, and she's LEC themed Zaya. Um, I don't know the people who made its names, and I feel sincerely bad about that, so I'm just gonna ask you to edit their names in in your video at some point, or tag them, and I'll tweet it out on Twitter, just because I don't have that information in hand. I put this on and ran on stage, and that's about it. Um, but they were super awesome, they put this together for us, and yeah. Yeah, we will definitely put them all in the description and the video links, and uh, you will see their names on the on the screen right now. What you can see, unfortunately, are these amazing Zaya feet with, uh, yeah, very scary claws. Uh, well, we can't feet, actually. Um, how comfortable is this whole outfit in general? All right, so for the first hour, incredibly comfortable. But as we've gone on, every individual piece has started to sweat. Um, it's very difficult to walk with bird feet. You kind of always have to lift your legs, um, if you can see my legs. And the wig, wall fantastic. I have a big dome, just like a humongous head. So this wig does not, like, it fits, but it is definitely squeezing my brain. And now, like, as every minute goes on, I, the pain grows little by little. But otherwise, incredibly comfortable. Okay, Im imaginative for sure. Uh, amazing. Can we expect more cosplays at maybe Athens? Um, we already saw Roman, you know, getting in the action a couple of times. So sure. will you consistently join the cosplay gang? I'm... I love this. I do not have the time to make this, but I'm like seriously considering commissioning this because I'm actually having a ton of fun. But I will say we own this cosplay now, so expect me and Frost Zaya slash Rakan in the future at some point. Otherwise, if there are any pro teams that want to throw down and bet on some cosplay, I'm always down personally. I'm always down to take the risk. Uh, so yeah, just like, what up? Show up on Euphoria. You want to see it? Let's let's go. Specifically Odoamne, because he's always, I think, a little sheepish about this kind of stuff, but takes him out of his comfort zone. I'm calling you out, Odo. If you want to, if you want to do a cosplay bet, let's go. Damn, and you're really passionate about it. You can tell by the beard and everything as well. I mean, is that going to go out anytime soon? I have no idea. Um, I wish <laughs> I could say that I was like passionate and did my prep, but what you can't see is that I've like shaved none of my body hair, so I'm like clearly not ready. And on top of that, the makeup lady was like, "I have this blue stuff. Do you want to use it?" And I was like, "Yeah, all right, why not?" Like, definitely. The the fine details were very much a stroke of luck, and not um, me being a super diligent person who's good at their job. No. Just so, any final words to the, the LEC crowd that is very excited for your cosplaying future and that of Frost and the entire LEC crew, of course? Um, thank you to everyone who supported us doing weird stuff and kind of being out of the box. I always like to think that for the most part, outside of these like last, like the last week when like most of the games are kind of troll games, at least this G2 game today, that we do a really good job of just BSing a ton when it doesn't matter and then when the games are serious, being serious. And I hope people like that because for me, I don't want to be sports center. That shit's really boring to me. I want I want to be more than that because like I don't know. We're we're gamers, we're nerds, we're like having a good time and like yeah, we're just chilling. I hope people like it and uh, yeah, thank you for everyone who's supported this effort. Slash harassed us when we didn't resolve the bet sooner. It did take like a year, so but at the end of the day, you delivered. A man always true to his worth. Thank you so much, Dracos, for your time. And uh, yeah, thank you so much Do the for... the awkward left hand handshake. Yeah, there you go. definitely. Right there. Amazing cosplay, 100%. Make sure to let them know which cosplay they should make in the future. And any pros, of course, call them out on Twitter. Yeah, let's I'm do very it. excited cosplay for this. Cosplay battles. Cosplay battles, the next step. Thank you so much. Of course.
We'd especially like to thank Krzysztof Buinovic, Erich Althaus, Lukas Legal, Lazy Raven, and Adam Novosviat for your continuous and very special support, and of course all the people whose names you see scrolling past you right now. We have a lot of amazing projects, and of course Worlds 2019 in Europe coming up, so thank you so much for supporting us and enabling us to do our work. Thank you.